All right guys, so I got all of my sheathing up here and I'm gonna do this by myself. We're gonna start in this far corner. We'll start with the one inch overhang or the one foot overhang. So we're gonna rip this first board down. It should be seven feet to that stud. And uh, I have two by sixes down at the bottom screwed into the, uh, to the fascia. That way it can hold it right in place and not hang over. It should be the perfect spot to where we wanna mount it. Uh, get that in there and then we'll start working our way up where I placed these boards is gonna be kind of tough uh, because the eight foot rafter right there is where it's ending so I might have to move these around uh, shuffle a little bit but let's get to it All right guys, so I'm here on top of the roof. Um, very hard to uh, manipulate these four by eight sheets of, uh, what is it, five eighths plywood uh, around the roof by yourself on an A12 pitch. So I didn't get much recording in. Let me just show you what I got. Um, and I'll show you what I did with the valley and whatnot. So it's all zip taped. I st I'm actually starting on the, uh, the drip edges. So that's already up here. This is kind of late. I just used on the ridge, I just did zip tape. And then uh, over here in the valleys, I actually used, well, I just put zip tape on there because we were going, I was trying to beat the rain and we are going camping. So I threw zip tape down and, and thought I got it decently uh, good. But I came back with some, uh, some of this valley specific stuff and it's not huge but I think it'll help us be watertight for now. And, uh, you know, obvious, obviously stuff is gonna have to change um, to get this roof tied in here. I'm just not to that point yet, so I'm not super concerned about it. But yeah, this is pretty heavy duty stuff. So hopefully that helps out. Today we are moving right along back with our project. We had a nice week on camping, um, but we gotta get back to this to get this thing done. So. Right now, I have to frame in the gable end and then we will sheathe it. Um, that way we can get to our soffits and then we can move on and put the windows and the doors in and make this tight. Still gotta do the roof and everything, but uh, let's get this thing done real fast. I don't know how it's gonna be recording this. Uh, it's kinda high up there, so we'll see what we can do, okay? 
If you guys aren't already subscribed, make sure you drop down below, hit that like and subscribe button, bell notifications for videos twice a week as we expand our homestead. We'd love to have you. All right, so we just got this framed out and uh, it's not gonna be able to be one piece, but uh, we do have full width on the board height-wise, a little over four feet. So we're just gonna break it right off in the middle. That way there's no like uh, messy overhang there. It's just gonna be one continuous piece to the corner, right on the lip right there. So it's 79.5. It's gonna be two complete pieces instead of chopping it up. Well, I guess three. We're gonna do a little triangle up top to finish it off, but uh, let's cut this and get it done. For the first stud, I just used measuring tape. Uh, well, actually the first two, I used it. And then uh, for the outer two, I just used a square. Uh, makes it a little more accurate. This is, if your measuring tape's not completely level, it could be a little bit off. But uh, we made sure we leveled those when we put those in, so they're nice and plumb. Uh, so let's get this done. So kind of missed the recording on that. I uh, kind of messed up the first side. Uh, I didn't go out at the top. So I had to do some filler pieces. It's just not as neat. Um, not proud of it, but I'll, I'll show it because not everything's perfect. And uh, yeah, it's all done. So we're gonna get started taping on this thing. Let's go. All right, that is all done. Next thing we gotta do is box out the soffits on the end and then get those installed. And this thing will be tight. Keep moving forward. 
one step at a time. Make sure you're following along on the playlist uh, as we build this 14 by 14 edition uh, by ourselves. So pretty exciting stuff. We're excited to have a little bit more room. Hope you join us.